Hi there guys, this is Nikhil from Greedy Tech. In this video, I am going to show you how you can connect a pen drive to NVIDIA Tegra node and access the files in the pen drive. As you can see, I have already connected my 32GB Strontium USB 3 pen drive which is formatted in FAT32 file system to the Tegra node. So once we have connected it, we will get a notification saying that the USB storage has been connected. So let's open up ES Explorer. So on the left side, if you scroll down, you can see that USB drive A is connected. That is our pen drive. So let me just open it. So these are the contents. Let me open the video. So as you can see, the video is playing flawlessly without any lag. So let me show you the location of the video. Let's go to properties. As you can see, the location of the video is in USB drive. And it's a 720p video. So it's that simple. As I've already mentioned, this is a FAT32 file system pen drive. If you try to connect a NTFS or an XFAT file system pen drive, then it will not detect the pen drive. So to unmount it, just go to settings, then to storage, then scroll down to the bottom. And over there, you can find the option to unmount the SD card. Just click OK over there to unmount it. Just give it some time and it will unmount the drive. So now guys, I am trying to connect a 16 GB pen drive in which is in XFAT format. So I get a message saying that it is preparing the SD card but nothing shows up. So let's go to settings and then to storage. Let's scroll down. Over here I am trying to mount the SD card manually. It says it's preparing the SD card but it doesn't mount the USB drive. So it only means that you can't mount an XFAT file system pen drive. So if you want to mount an XFAT or NTFS file system, you might have to consider rooting your device. So that's it guys. Thanks for watching the video. If you have any doubts, go ahead and leave a comment below this video. And if you found this video to be helpful, then please like the video and share it with your friends. And if it is the first time you are watching one of my videos, then please go ahead and subscribe to my channel to see more videos just like this.